This is take three of my cloud check vlog. Take three. What? Okay, anyway, this is basically a cloud check vlog. I'm going to keep it short. Let's hope. Maybe it'll be shorter than the first couple of takes because those were kind of long. Yeah. Um, update Atlantis. I'm upgrading to the five milliliter juice capacity that Aspire just came out with. I am also going to keep track of exactly how many tanks I fill before the coil goes so I can get some sort of idea about how long my coils are really going to last me. Um, as we know, my first coil didn't last me nearly as long as it should have. So I'm going to be even more careful. I'm going to pay attention to this. I get a little juice back. A little in my mouth and you kind of hear it. Um, the day that the coil went, I didn't have that. That was the only difference and I'm remembering it now. I will remember that again if I ever feel like I'm not getting the spit back. It the coil's not good anymore. It's over. It's over. So I'm going to pay attention to that and of course give you updates on that. I've decided that is what I want to keep doing. Um, I did take apart that coil. I should have taken pictures. I pulled the coil out and took all the materials out and I had the, the typical hole that you see in the initial cotton outline that goes around the coil. Um, and the ceramic part was not flaky or fucked up in any way. It was just brown. It was not like you see some pictures where things are all torn apart and it looks like fiberglass. It did not look like that for me. It just looked like more cotton. And the outside ring was what it was. It was just normal. So um, I will take a picture of the next coil because even though I don't plan on blowing that coil, <laughs> I plan on changing it when it's supposed to. I'm going to show it to you, what it looks like when it's changed the way it's supposed to be changed. Okay? I'm going to show it to you. I'm also going to <coughs> get some vodka. And when I do major flavor changes, I'm not going to do it every time. You know, like if I go from Crunch Berry to Fruit Loops right now, I'm not going to fucking clean my fucking coil. Okay? That doesn't make sense to me. Because it'll just blend right into the next flavor. Uh, when I do major flavor changes... I will be sure to do that and see if I can get a little extra life out of it. I would like to see seven to eight days, ten days out of a coil. If I can't, okay, I'm just going to be vigilant about changing it exactly on the seventh day, blah, 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 no matter what. And hopefully I'll never have a coil blow out on the fifth day or fourth day, whatever it was that I had it. Also, I want to give you a heads up about February. Guys, we're in a new year, and y'all know that. Oh, I got some treats in my pocket. Um, this February is going to be really stellar, guys, and I want to give you a clue. If you put your nose to the grindstone, and if you make decisions about what you want to be and how you want to be and what you love and doing what you love and being really authentic and you're really going for it in that first week of February... You're going to see one of the best months you've ever seen yet. Um, and it'll just be the beginning of this year. You know, January for me was a little bit of a struggle. I had, um, actually, my father passed away. Just the 22nd. So I didn't even know what was happening. I, I'm like, I'm still in shock completely. However, I do know this. February, I've got this feeling, guys, and... You got to know this feeling is there and it extends out to everybody. Anybody that watches this and takes heed and realizes that in that first week of February, don't do things you don't want to do. Don't be around people you don't want to be around. Don't think things you don't want to think. Don't watch things on TV you don't want to watch. Stay away from the news. Keep your nose to the books. Keep yourself moving in the direction of your dreams and you will see shit happen that you won't believe. Let me tell you something. We're also, on the third, we'll be celebrating my second month, Smoke Free. That's one thing my father didn't get to know, is that I quit smoking. He wanted me to quit smoking, so I think he knows now. Um, pretty sure. Uh, so, I, I'm really excited about February. That's all I gotta say. Watch the fuck out. I'm on fire. Just watch the fuck out. 
Um, I'm going to keep doing videos, keep doing things, and you guys will see me and everything. And some of you guys are friending me on Facebook already. Keep friending me. Friend me. I got fan page. I got personal page. I got business fan page. I got everything. So come on over to Facebook and hang out with me. Get to see what's up with me. If you look me up, you will see um, my personal page. I have sunflowers behind my picture. On my business page, I have purple background. On Tara Vapes, I'm blowing the cloud. It's pretty simple to figure out. I'm going to vape again. I want to tell you an awesome quote I found tonight that I've never seen before. And I absolutely love it. And I'm going to read it to you right now. I don't know. I can't speak Latin, but I'm going to try. In Latin, it's Des Titus Ventes Remos Had Hib. And what that means is, if the wind will not serve, take to the oars. That shall be your motto for February, guys. Make the fucking waves happen. You can do it. Everybody can do it. Um, if you're interested in quitting smoking, you know, take a look. Watch my videos. I'm a newbie, so I give all sorts of my personal opinions. And there's so, so many people out there that give really great ad advice. Um, you know, you, you just figure it out. If you got any questions, leave them underneath the video. I'll tell you what I think you should start with. I don't think you should start with a cigalite. I can tell you that right now. I want you to quit smoking. So. I'm thinking Aspire, Nautilus Mini. Um, don't start here. This will be your next step, your second step. And a, uh, maybe do the Aspire Nautilus Mini Premium Starter Kit. That might be just right for you. That's a satisfying vape for someone that's just quitting smoking. Um, this, if you do start, I got to charge this. If you do start with this, don't start at 12 watts. You will choke. 8 watts. And don't go higher than 12 with this tank on here. <coughs> In my opinion. But anyway, back to this. A lot of fun. Water vapor. Hello. Thank you. Thank you, water vapor gods. Whoever invented this... Just bless his heart. <laughs> anyway, fight for your vaping rights. You want to quit smoking and you want a healthier alternative. You want to be a healthier person and you don't want to do Chantex because you don't want to lose your mind and go crazy and do something you don't even remember. I've got horror stories. I've heard people do horrible fucking scary things on that shit. Don't take it. Um, I'm not the FDA or a doctor, but if the FDA will approve that, whatever you know oh god they let you they let fucking people shoot the fucking animals up with hormones and shit and spray fucking fumigants on your fucking food and you're gonna let them decide about this i don't think so you just gotta be safe you just gotta know what you're doing and every time that you think you're gonna upgrade you gotta think twice and then you gotta go and study it as much as you possibly can because you're holding power in your hands um just you know I would have never thought of quitting. I didn't even think of quitting until I did. And I researched how people were actually staying off of cigarettes. And the only people that are actually staying off of cigarettes are people that move to vaping. And then they, they eventually quit that. So what the heck? I'm just saying. These are just my opinions. I'm going to attempt the fade to cloud. This is the reason why the last video wasn't done. So what's the, what's the homework, guys? Crush February like you have nobody's business, like it's only your business, and that's that. Go get you what's yours, man. Go do it and do it with a big fucking smile on your face. Stay out of the news. Stay happy. And uh, keep doing what you love. And, uh, you know, vape on, folks.